First up right now at five, we start with that breaking news on the shoreline. A neighborhood in Brantford on lockdown where police are in a standoff with a barricaded person. This is still all unfolding after a gunman opened fire on officers and now he is holed up in a home. Channel 3 New Haven Bureau Chief Matt McFarland is alive near this very active scene. And Matt, what are police telling us right now? Well, Aaron and Mark, police are saying this is still unfolding, still very active, still not safe at all. So they're asking folks to stay away from this area. As you can see, uh, northbound Route 1 here in Brantford, that's closed off to traffic. They actually also closed off uh, the exit ramp of 53 on I-95. They don't want people coming into this area. And you can see the police all up there on Main Street. Now, Brantford police tell us uh, they got a 911 call just after noon of uh, reports of shots fired in the area of Main Street near Cherry Hill and North Harbor Roads. Officers respond. They were met with heavy gunfire. Actually, officers were pinned down until they can get an armored vehicle in there to remove them. Uh, but again, uh, this has been an hours long standoff. We're told a person who is now barricaded inside uh, the second floor of a uh, was a business on the bottom floor, apartments on the top floor as well. Now, number of different police departments here assisting with Brantford PD. That includes the Connecticut State Police, the South Central Regional SWAT team with members from East Haven, North Haven, North Brantford. Also, we saw members of New, uh, New Haven's police departments, their emergency services unit, they're on the scene as well. They're all here again responding to a person who they said fired shots and is now barricaded. Now, spoke to a 16-year-old eyewitness. He tells us he was riding his bike to Branford's Green this afternoon when a police officer turned around in front of him and got out with a rifle. The team tells us that's when this the, the, the guys over at Shelley's Garden Shop pulled him inside. He says they were there for about 15 to 20 minutes. They took cover together while the shooting took place. He says, again, police then pulled an armored car up to them, got them inside so they could be evacuated to safety. The cop came out with his rifle, and uh, I believe the guy shooting at them was in the second store, uh, the second story, a uh, couple doors down. It was silence, shouting, shots, and it was just an endless cycle. I think I'm still in shock. I don't think the gravity of the situation has set in yet, but I'm sure that after a few hours, everything will be okay. Again, a large police presence here in Brantford. Police dealing with a barricaded person uh, who started shooting at police after they responded for a call of shots fired early this afternoon. Again, police asking folks to avoid this area of Brantford. That's Main Street, Cherry Hill Road, North Harbor Road, saying, again, it is just not safe. Again, asking folks to stay away from this area as this investigation continues. We're live with the Mobile Newsroom in Brantford. Matt McFarland, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.